Hi, welcome, Simon here. In this video, I'll do a teardown on the uh, Asus Gaming Laptop. Let's go ahead and identify the model. It's GA402R. If you're looking to upgrade the RAM, changing out the hard drive, changing out the battery, then more likely this video would kind of give you a guideline on what to do and how to do. Be using a Phillips screwdriver. Let's go ahead and remove all the screws here. Looks like the screws on the top and the middle, they're all the same. The one at the bottom is much shorter. And the bottom right screw does not come off. Once you have removed all the screw, remove the back cover, you can jump right into the computer. So this is the M.2 SSD drive. Remove that screw. And you can slide the M.2 at 45 degree angle to your right. That's how you remove it. Now, if you're interested to recover the data, for whatever reason, you're thinking to upgrade the computer or buying a new one you need to get one of these USB adapter so that you can slide your original M.2 drive in it install hold it down right and then you want to insert into a different computer a secondary computer or new computer and this would act like a USB flash drive so that you can recover and pull the data out of this um, using this USB adapter I'll link it down in the description below where you can uh, find it directly from either Amazon or eBay to get the, uh, the USB tools. And to disconnect the battery, making sure that you want to slide this, this metal clipper. I believe it needs to be opened up. I'm not 100% sure. Let me see. Yep. So this metal clipper here is locked if it's to the left that means it's locked you push it to the right you can see that the clipper is open once it's open you can remove the uh, connector by simply lift it straight up so that is for the battery now to remove the ram go ahead and push the both side of the metal clipper you push it both sides away and you can remove the ram by sliding it out and again, this RAM here is uh, DDR5. You can see it says PC5. That stands for DDR5. All right, so before I, you know what, instead of do a teardown of removing everything, I apologize. Now it looks like there's a lot more work to do. The entire heat thing have, have to come up and whatnot. But I just like to see if I can turn on the computer. So technically this computer is a problem for me and the computer is not turning on well it turns on but there's no display okay so let me kind of uh, clean the RAM slot here wipe it down a little bit insert the RAM okay let's see if I can turn on the computer get any display of it I know the computer is not going to boot to Windows because I removed the hard drive but at least uh, turn on right I can see that the keyboard has a uh, light on it you can see that the uh, the RBG keyboard light is on but the display is definitely nothing in there mm. 
still no display on it so to me it does look like it's not the RAM issue uh, definitely has to do with the motherboard It's either the graphics card or the CPU uh, these are the, the very common thing that you know AMD breaks and if they break this is not replaceable technically just a heat sink uh, the graphics card or the CPU is soldered to the motherboard so unfortunately that motherboard would have to be you know replaced entirely okay so anyway I'll cut it short I'll try to recover the data here uh, that's my goal is to see if I can see anything in the hard drive and try to save it and retire the computer thanks for watching until next time bye now